Well, this is the accessibility um, menu icon. So let's go really quick. I'm gonna show you uh, where to go and um, remove or turn off this feature. And after that, I'm gonna show you how important is this just in case that you're wondering uh, why is there floating on your screen. So let's go really quick and please subscribe to the channel, smash the like button and share this video for your friends just in case that uh, they would like to uh, learn how to use this one or to remove it from the screen. So open phone settings and you usually you're gonna get to this screen, okay? So just scroll down and uh, locate accessibility. There you go. Open accessibility and then interaction and dexterity. Assistant menu, slide to the left at the bottom, confirm, turn off, and then uh, the flooring icon has been disappeared, okay? Just in case that you would like to have this uh, accessibility menu because uh, you need some sh uh, shortcuts there, sort of quick access, some those uh, uh, shortcuts. So let's just same step, come to assistant menu and enable feature, okay? Okay, so to turn off assistant menu, let's um, slide to the right. You're gonna see the menu immediately uh, appears on the screen. Uh, if you want to see other options, assistant menu uh, uh, men uh, shortcut at the bottom of this next screen, assistant menu shortcut. You're gonna see a person icon at the need of your screen on the bottom right. If you touch this person, your assistant menu will disappear. Okay, so only you can uh, touch once to bring up uh, the uh, icon, the floating icon. Okay, so gonna touch this icon and these are the quick buttons that you can uh, control your screen. Okay, so your navigation buttons will be in this uh, section. So recent tabs, right? So this is the tab history they went using on the phone. Um, and then your home screen, previous page, and so on. Uh, you want to screen off, you, instead of pressing the buttons, you can just touch that and turn off your screen. Uh, double tap to open it, enter your screen password, and let's check another volume. So instead of pressing these buttons, you can uh, set up or volume down from here. Okay, on top of that. Another one is screenshot. Let's say that you are on the favorite display screen and you want to capture a picture to save it on your phone touch screenshot okay and this is your screenshot um, now let's go again touch this arrow to go to the next page and here you can bring out the power menu so instead of pressing this button just and you can touch the access accessibility menu and Power off your phone, restart your phone, uh, open your medical info, emergency call, or and set up your site function buttons. Okay. Um, so I'm gonna touch my home button to go to the home screen. Okay, you can now you from here you can also use screen control, pinch to zoom, uh, quick panel with with uh, applications that you can access, a notification panel. So if you want to open notification panel from here, just touch this one and um, you're gonna see your notification panel slowing down. Uh -huh. Clear that. Okay, so this is the notification panel. You don't have any notification right now. Uh, so yeah, uh, 
Okay, so this is uh, the functions of this accessibility menu. I'm going to touch this person to disappear it just in case that I don't want to have it, but when I want to use it, just touch the person and you can move up and down your icon and keep it wherever you want, somewhere that won't um, disturb your use of screen. Okay. Well, I hope that this information was helpful for you. Uh, let me know in comments if you have any questions and please subscribe to the channel, smash the like button and share this video for your friends. Thanks so much.